Welcome to the girls' soccer sectional final featuring defending state champs Matia Valley and Plainfield North. A win for the Mustangs puts them a game close to getting back to the state series, while the Tigers are looking to continue their best season in program history as they make their first ever sectional final appearance. Tigers are already attacking early, but the Mustang defense reacts quickly and knocks the ball away to prevent a goal. Tyra King takes it the other way, and despite Hannah Bukowski making a play, King tries her strike, but does not get the much needed curve. Corner kick time for the Tigers, and the ball just bounces off Tessa Fagerson's head and sneaks its way by an inch for the first goal of the game. Fagerson wants some more, but her shot on net goes off the post and Alyssa Gluting saves it. Don't you dare counter out. After a couple of moves, she fires that ball and it goes in beautifully to double up the Tigers' lead to 2 nothing. Mustangs get a quick goal from Tyra King to cut the deficit within one goal. Now can they tie this game up? Tiger goalie Hannah Bukowski says, no way, I'm not letting that happen. As for Fagerson, she keeps doing her thing, and oh my goodness, what a goal by the DePaul commit. Plainfield North takes a 3-1 lead at the break. In the second half, the Mustangs are looking for any type of score, and Kylie Janish has a chance, but her shot goes wide of the net. Another one for the Ponies, but the Tiger defense continues to show their fight by showing absolutely no love to their opponent. Plainfield North is back on the attack, and Mia Davis scores another goal, and that's the dagger. For the first time in school history, Plainfield North wins the girls' soccer sectional championship after a 4-1 win over Matia Valley. The Tigers will take on 2021 state champs O'Fallon in the super sectionals. I'm so proud of my team, and this being like the first step past the sectional final, like just means so much to us and everybody worked so hard to get to this point and we're just so proud of everybody. This was an entirely a revenge game because they ended our season last year so we came in like everybody was trying their best even like the people on the bench played their part and that was just huge for us like this was a state championship game just as much as the rest of the game so yeah. Going into the season we all knew that this was our year because of how many seniors we have and all of the incoming talent that we had this season and we were just really looking forward to making history. I'm so proud like we we're undefeated this season for the first time in like um, season history, so I'm really proud of them. Um, we worked through a lot of stuff, a lot of adversity. We've had a lot of challenges and we fought through them. We didn't get the result we wanted today, but it's okay because I'm just so proud of them. Like they've worked so hard. I'm gonna miss like our like pregame like um, mosh pits. We would always have so much fun in the locker rooms. We would just play music. I'm gonna miss like our team dinners. I'm just gonna miss being around the girls like because I love all of them. 